Today we're going to go over how to remove an application. Let's start by opening up the terminal. Let's get a list of all the aptitude installed packages on our system. To do this, we're going to type in sudo apt list space dash dash install. Once you hit enter, you'll be prompted for your credentials. Enter your credentials and hit enter again. Upon completion of entering your credentials, the system will run through every single installed application and give you a full list of all the details as far as every application currently installed with aptitude on your Linux Mint system. But what about if you already know the name of the package? For instance, you know that the name of the package is Firefox. To do this, you would simply add a pipe space grep space Firefox to your command and hit enter. This should output something similar as to what you see on the screen. Now that we've discovered that Firefox has two different packages installed, how do we remove that? To do so, we'll run a simple command of sudo apt remove Firefox. Once you execute this command, it will ask you yes if you want to continue or no if you want to stop. I would suggest not using the dash Y unless you're scripting this. The reason being is you want to make sure that what it is actually removing is what you want it to move. For instance, in this particular situation, it's attempting to remove something called Firefox Mint Chat. This isn't actually what we want to remove, so we're going to hit no or N for no and hit enter. If we jump back and look at that original command window, we can see the actual names of the applications we want to remove, specifically Firefox-Locale-EN. Now that we've corrected the actual package name to sudo apt remove Firefox-Locale-EN, we can hit enter. We'll notice now that the correct package for uninstall is being listed. We're going to hit Y to continue. If we run our command again to search to see what is actually installed, we'll notice that we're now missing the Firefox locale En. However, we still have Firefox Wilma installed. If we go back to our original configuration and we run our command again, sudo apt remove Firefox forward slash Wilma and we hit enter, the system is going to indicate that this is actually Firefox Mint Chat. Since we've confirmed that this is the package that we want to remove, we're going to hit Y for yes and then hit enter. While on most systems we would be done here, in Linux, unfortunately when you install an application, it may install dependencies. But simply removing the application doesn't uninstall the dependencies. These dependencies have a tendency of becoming orphaned. To start, we're going to auto-remove the orphan dependencies. This command purges the additional connections or any symbolic links that go along with the original application. This is important if you decide that you want to reinstall an application. Keep in mind that if you have additional configuration files in your home directory, you'll need to manually remove those after this process. Enter the command sudo apt auto remove space dash dash purge, hit enter. You'll note that the command finishes on this particular instance with nothing changed. That's because our built-in Firefox process does not have any dependencies installed. This concludes removing aptitude packages in terminals.